and welcome to our video describing how to build with manual tasks using BPMN. Let's first describe our pre-built model using manual tasks. As you'll see, we have already described that our process starts at 0800 on Mondays using the timer start event. We have also identified a set of activities that occur during our training process. We conduct instructions, lecture on BPMN, and then assess students' performance. We use the manual task type to illustrate that these tasks are completed manually without the assistance of a computer. When we assess students' performance, we have a decision to make. We must determine the student's level of understanding of a given topic. We use an exclusive gateway to illustrate the diverging of two possible options from our determination. If they understand it, they pass. If a student failed at grasping a concept we taught, we would review our training material. We use a manual task to illustrate that we manually review our training material to determine if an update is required. We use the exclusive gateway to show two options. First is the training material does not require an update in which case our sequence flow merges back into the process using the exclusive gateway to merge our process. The second option we illustrate is that an update is required. If an update is required, we modify our training material. We could use the manual task, but since all of our training material is built using software, we will actually select the user task described in the next section. A user task is a task that is completed with the assistance of software. After we modify our training material using our BPMN software, our process merges back to the main process and our process ends. Thank you again for joining us. If you enjoyed this video, please take a moment to hit the like button. Also, please subscribe if you're interested in learning more about upcoming BPMN videos. And leave a comment below. Let us know what you think.